what's up guys it's your boy Tiba back with another video so today is a very special day you guys know for the past like four years or five years whatever on this channel I've been in high school well today is high school graduation baby and we about to get it you know Nike a lit on me always got to keep it on me you know what I'm saying today is graduation day and I'm about to be filming and uh make sure you guys leave a like subscribe and uh, I guess I'll see you guys when I'm walking down the path with my parents, cause my parents are here. We're staying at this hotel. This hotel is pretty cool, you know. Just walk in. Give you guys a little tour. So the place looks like fucking around. Hi, ma'am. How are you? Look at him in the suit. Oh, it's in the in the wardrobe. Yeah, please get it. You check in the wardrobe. Nah, I didn't. <laughs> Just a little tour, you know. Quick, quick vlog. Shout out Milna. Um, but oh, we're about to go to the thing. I guess I'll see you guys there. Yeah. Okay, so I'm about to drive the car. And, um, we're about to hop in this bay, you know. So this is the car I rented. Um, this is the car I rented. It's pretty cool. Who me? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we get, we getting out. Um, yeah, this. Let's stop the car. Wait, wait, where's the stop? Yeah. get it right okay guys so walk around and um this is like the the scenery can you all see what i see anyways this is like what we got going on um i don't know what else to say to be honest we're just waiting for the graduation and um we're gonna see you guys when we see you guys graduation day buddies you know we're all here we're getting ready Graduation day in this bay. We gotta walk on the on the pathway. Yeah. happened in that moment. The first is that when the lid fell inside, I wasn't still holding the box, meaning that I didn't get 240,000 kilovolts of electricity running through my body. The second is when the flash went up, I didn't breathe in and get internal, internal burns, which would undoubtedly have killed me. <laughs> in that second, if either one of those things had happened any differently, 
I most likely would not be here talking to you today. And if I had survived, I'm certain that the quality of life that I've led to date would, would have been significantly reduced or diminished. I spent the best part of the next six months in and out of hospital, obviously unable to go to school and do much else apart from recover and do rehab. Such was my determination to go to high school the next year that through friends at Broaders Primary School, shout out to any ex-Broaders uh, pupils here as well, <laughs> um, who, started, who shared notes with me that I was able to pass my PSLE exam with straight A's. A few of you who were there in 2002 when I started my journey at Kingswood will remember that at the time, I still had a lot of pigment patches and wore bandages on my left cheek and pressure garments on my arms, chest and face that would earn me the nickname Mzegezege in some corners. <laughs> <laughs> what I've never really told people at the time was that my parents really didn't want me to come to Kingswood in the state that I was in. I'd also been offered a partial bursary to attend Kingswood, which I'll always be eternally grateful to Mr. Hawke, then Kingswood headmaster, for, and, the, and the bursary incredibly special in the way it comes together to celebrate our losses, celebrate our victories, sorry, and lick our wounds after losses. As you collect your ties today, some of you might be sad to be leaving Kingswood and others happy that your time here is done and dusted. Whilst we cannot discount your lived experience at the school, I am certainly that it definitely, I'm certain that it definitely wasn't all bad. I'd love to encourage you to maintain the bonds that you have created whilst you were here at Kingswood and forge new bonds with Kings, old Kingswoodians, both younger and those to come in the years ahead. I'd love to meet as many of you as I can at OK events in Johannesburg and beyond. Whilst I know it's not always easy to come back to Kingswood, I myself have only been here three times since I matriculated, and it still blows my mind just how much the school has changed over the last 16 years. I would like to challenge each and every one of you to find ways to contribute to this wonderful community in your own ways, no matter how small those contributions may be. I certainly know Kerry would love and appreciate that as well. The reality of it, the, the reality of it all is that whilst we've all been very privileged to receive a world-class education at Kingswood College, the matric certificate that you will know, you will receive shortly is undoubtedly exactly the same as any other in the country. The true value of the education at the true value of the education at Kingswood is in the lessons we learn along the way, the people whose lives we impact, the memories we keep and hold dear, and most importantly, the community we build together. Brian Solis said, community is much more than belonging to something. It is about, some, it is about, it's about doing something together that makes belonging matter. And I certainly believe our Kingswood community matters. Congratulations to the class of 2022. I wish you all the best on your future endeavors. And I'm, I hope no matter how far life takes you, Kingswood College will always be near and dear to your heart, because it certainly is to mine. Thank you very much. Good everybody. Afternoon. I promise you I won't be speaking long. I've got many speeches over the next few days. All I wanted to say was go in peace to love and serve the Lord. In the name of Christ. Amen. Thank you, everyone. Don't go. Don't go. Don't go. Okay, guys, so this is the leave us part of the dinner. You know, uh, I don't know, I don't know what to say, but this is the um, scenery, um, as you can see, we have, um, I don't know. That is the end of the video, guys. I got my OK tie. We official. If you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like, subscribe. I will see you guys in the next video. High school, we out. Gang.